Welcome back guys, it's Kiso and Playground here and today we'll be talking about how my project got removed from Scratch. So, I got a message from the Scratch team on June 13, 2024 stating, for Project Wizard Defense, the Scratch team has removed this project because it is too violent or scary. Some subjects are too intense for a service used by young children, including realistic depictions of weapons, excessive blood and gore, references to violent or scary media or trends or horror images, and jump scares. Scratch is for kids ages 8 and up, so it is important to keep your content friendly and appropriate for all ages. Please follow the community guidelines when using Scratch. Alright, so this is the game that they removed. And in my opinion, I don't believe it should be removed because it doesn't have, you know, a realistic depiction of weapons. I think that's why they removed my game, but I don't think my knife looks realistic at all. So basically, it's a game where you can control the wizard and click space to shoot fireballs at the crows, right? And the crows will throw knives down at you, try to hurt you, and if you run out of lives, you'll be useful, but, um, they'll shoot knives down at you, and if you get hit by those knives, and, yeah, so that that's basically the game, right? And they removed it, probably because of the realistic depictions of weapons. And, um, there's other games like the Ninja 5, right? So there's other games like the Ninja 5, right? They have just as much weapons and even if not more weapons than my game. And I don't understand why mine was um, removed, even though this one has not been removed for over six years. And I love this game. This game is a really fun game. I really enjoyed this game as a child. But the thing is that I don't understand um, how, why they scratch and decided to remove my project when there's other games like this that are so popular among people and they somehow have all these weapons like just on the thumbnail right and they still haven't managed to get removed so my question is there's games like this right and i really love this game as a child it's really fun to me but the thing is that there are literally katanas and swords in this game and if you don't call this a realistic depiction of weapon i don't know what is i mean in the next level you can literally have the opportunity to kill a guy throwing shurikens at you by deflecting the shuriken and killing him. I don't know why that lag lagged out, but it's okay. I think that'll work. Yeah, there we go. So that, that's what's supposed to happen. But anyway, I don't know why they would go after me when there's other games like this. There's a ton more games that are just like this game. And honestly, I, I think they're really fun. I really like these games. And um, I don't know how come they get their project still up, right? And then I, mine gets removed for having realistic depictions of weapons, even though a lot more games have those type of things. And this one's a lot more popular, so it should probably get a lot more attention from other people. Also, I think I might have coded the Wizard Defense game on my channel, on Kids Going Playground. So please do not code this, because they might remove it for having, quote, realistic depictions of weapons. But, um... Yeah, please don't code this. I mean, they might remove it for some reason. But anyways, please like, share, and subscribe. Comment in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys next time.